All right, guys, we just got uh, this 94 Integra all on jack stands. It's off the ground. And uh, we're just gonna be taking basically stuff off, like panels and stuff, not the engine just yet, because I need to get that compression tested. We could do that almost right now. I just wanna wait for the engine to kind of cool down a bit. So safe to say this shell is not, uh, not gonna be a buildable shell because it's kind of clapped. But we got the seats out and the armrest out for now. Um, we just put everything over here on this side. Just kind of laying everything out. Homie shows up with the S2. Okay. This thing's super clean. Super. How you been, bro? Good, just taking this thing apart. No, no, that's just from the, uh, this car was in the movie, or some movie or whatever, and they used the, uh, like fake plastic? Yeah, that's literally plastic or Seriously? something. Yeah, like touch it. It looks like glass, but, like, it's just plastic. Wow. Right? Cool. All right, so. I actually am gonna pull the motor and all the suspension and everything kind of right in the middle of the shop because um, I got dollies now under the shell. Well, I'm gonna move them out and stuff when I'm trying to pull the engine, but they're under there just to show you guys that one. And there's one back there with the tire on it. And when I drop the car after, they'll just kind of sit on the dollies and I'll push the car right to the door and then the tow truck can take it on its way. So I am gonna part it out here um but before i do i pulled all the uh, spark wires here and look how clean that is that purple i kind of like that purple a lot looks a lot cleaner in there it's a good sign but yeah i'm gonna uh take the spark plugs out and uh hook this guy up give it a couple cranks and see uh see what all the cylinders are at hard for you guys to see that but Let's give it a couple cranks and see what kind of compression we get. All right, so I don't even know what to say. Engine and trans is out. Um. Yeah, this is the most ghetto way I've pulled an engine so far. And I didn't even want to pull it this way. Car's like ready to tip over. It's like on an ankle and like five jacks. All right, so here we have the Integra. I didn't really film the engine getting pulled just because um, my phone was dead, unfortunately, and I didn't have Jake here. So we just had to kind of get it pulled because I want the RSX here. And when the guy comes and takes this shell, he's gonna come take the shell and then bring the RSX back, if that makes sense. I have a major mess now all over the shop. It's... It's pretty bad. Not bad, but like, you know, it smells bad in here and it looks bad in here and I don't like that. So we're gonna clean that up right now. And then we're gonna try and take the, uh, the front spindles out on both sides. We got the rear end out here. We got pretty much everything out of the car, um, except for like the dash and steering wheel part, which I do want. Um, and I gotta get this panel out, but for now, that's uh, that's something to worry about after. So, I got majority of it cleaned up. Everything's kind of stained now, which I gotta get some type of uh, concrete soap because it's still a little bit slippery everywhere. Um, but yeah, everything's pretty much cleaned up now. Uh, I'm gonna try and start taking out these uh, front spindles and then maybe the subframe, and then we'll go from there. All right, guys, so I'm pretty much done 
parting this thing out, dashes, everything's out, sunroof out, everything's out. I even cut out all the wiring too, just cause you can never have too much extra wiring. And uh, engine's out, everything's out, subframe's out. Both spindles are out. Subframe's right there, spindle's there, rear end there. Even got the gas tank out too, cause why not? Hatch sitting right there. Unplugged it properly so I didn't have to cut anything. Dash there, and then everything else just chilling right here. So this guy's pretty much done. And uh, I'm gonna be calling the, the scrap guy tomorrow so we can come pick this whole shell up and give me like 20, 30 bucks for it. I cut in here, don't ask me why I cut here, okay? I cut in here and there was legit a dead mouse sitting right there. I threw it in the garbage. I really don't want to find it. Oh, there it is, bro. 100%, there it is. Right there, that guy, the little dead guy. So don't, I don't even know how he got up in here. No, I don't even think it goes anywhere. But he got in there. I cut it open. He was sitting right there. It scared the, it scared the crap out of me. But other than that, we're done with this guy. And I just bought another car um, today. It's a, uh, I want to say like 06 Accord. It's got a K24 in it, five-speed transmission, um, OEM cat, all that for 500 bucks. So I think that one or the RSX that I have is going to be here next. And uh, I got to find a place for all these parts. All right, so we're going to move this. All right, so we got this thing basically, we're just messing around, but we got this thing moving around now, just kind of on uh, a tire right there. And then just um, so a wooden dolly at the front and it moves pretty good. Now uh, that's kind of how we're gonna move cars around here when we're parting them out to shells. We're gonna leave it there. A tow truck's gonna come right from here, pick it up and boom, super easy. Now we got all this space back that I have to clean up, especially all this oil. Now my floor looks like crap. So that's our next plan. We're gonna get a massive shelf right here. And that's where all these parts are gonna go pretty much. And uh, yeah, this car is done in a couple days. It's off to the scrappers. The floor still looks like immaculate in my opinion. So I'm gonna post this tonight and see if anyone wants the floors before tomorrow. Cause uh, yeah, I want this thing gone as fast as possible. All right, guys, so this is the time. Finally getting rid of this piece. Let me pull this from it. Oh yeah, let's go. Oh, those clear? Yeah, they clear perfectly. And just like that. So that's what I had on the back end right here. It was just sitting on two dollies and a tire. Got 40 bucks for this thing. Yeah, I'd get more if I brought it to the scrapyard myself, but wait for that tow and uh, and that truck combo soon. But yeah, all gone, he's gonna hook it up. 
Everything's mint. And uh, now we got some space back. When that finally moves, we'll have space and a train. This will be filled up. Everything's looking mint.